listen, I'm not so high and mighty and up on, you know, no high horse or think I'm better than anyone else. I've experienced situationships and sensual Asianships and situations that are less than queen mentality. It's going to take you farther than you wanted to go, keep you longer than you wanted to stay, and cost you more than you wanted to pay. I don't care if initially you agreed to be a secret, but it's time to stop. I know you got a story and you just don't want to wait. I bring no fame and Thank you for riding with me. My computer finally came in. Woohoo! You know, when I'm in my car, I like to think out loud. I want you to know, ladies and gentlemen, never, ever, ever be anybody's secret. You don't deserve to be anybody's secret. You have to change your mind. A changed mind is the most powerful tool in your arsenal. Queens are never a man's secret. Kings are never a woman's secret. You deserve more for your life. You deserve more for yourself. What is it, uh, K. Michelle, my life? She say, three years you've been doing the same thing you can hang it up you'll never get a ring because i know about it you know the song it's not gonna happen i don't care how many promises he or she makes they are stringing you along and you know why because you're allowing them to string you along you deserve everything that life has to offer you. You don't have to settle for less. You don't have to settle for being someone's secret. They can't even come uh, pick you up and take you nowhere. Can't even take you to buy ice cream cone. Can't take you uh, to the McDonald's drive through Why? Because him or her significant other might catch you guys. They might get found out. But deep inside, you know, deep inside, you, you're not with that. You're putting up a fakeade. Who else said it? Betty Wright. Having a piece of man is better than having no man at all. So I'm going to just take what I got and work with. You understand what I mean? Listen, that was back in the 70s. Uh, this is 2021. And if you're still being someone's secret, I need you to do some soul searching. You need to do some soul searching. You need to know what your worth is. You need to change your mind. Have that queen and that king mentality. It is a mentality. I don't care how big um, your butt is, how top heavy you are, what kind of package he working with nothing and nobody is worth your self-esteem and is worth you lowering your standards because somebody wants their cake and ice cream and eat it too it don't work like that i'm telling you i promise you i promise you you're gonna it it may hurt to let that person go but you gotta let your heart break so your soul can heal we're talking about your entire holistic health. It is not healthy for you emotionally, spiritually, psychologically, financially. It is not okay. You're not going to get that time back. I'm not saying that you don't have a good time with this person. And, and, and I'm not saying that you know it, it's it's all bad is it's all bad stop picture a stop sign in your head stop because you know what you're gonna reap what you sow karma 
what goes around comes around what comes around goes around and you want to you want to reap a good you want to sow a good harvest so that you can reap the blessings that god has for you you don't deserve to be somebody's side piece. don't do it it's not okay it's not cute it's not sexy and there's nothing fly about it so anyway supervisor slash friend so i'll be back vlogging more in just a bit sharing my story is my story not his story when I'm sharing this transparent, giving him the glory. I know you got a story, and you ain't got a way. You never know the difference a conversation makes.